Welcome everyone. New project today. This is, I'm, I'm assuming this one's going to be sort of a uh, palette cleanser. Should be fairly simple. I think it's only, yeah, it's only like a three star. And I saw it on here. I think it's only like 150 pieces. So it should be, ah, oh, there it is, 147 pieces. Although it is a 14 and up. So it may not be super simple, but it looks like a cool little haunted house situation going there. Got some decorations. Appears to have an LED in there. And, uh, I think that'll be fun. Be nice to have a little decoration for the spooky season coming up here. I guess just a couple of weeks away now. So let's, so let's pop this open and see what I've got myself into. I'm, ex I'm expecting this to be only one or two day build, but you know, once we get in there and get going, we'll we'll find out for sure. But uh, I'm optimistic that, that this is going to be not that bad. There's no, well, it says the models produce motion, but I don't, I don't see moving parts on there, so it might be more, <laughs> there might be more to this than I'm, I mean, I'm seeing. But, uh, so this is sort of like the uh, Taj Mahal in Notre Dame. This is sort of an unbranded one, just Halloween house, mechanical 3D puzzle. <laughs> I'd say there's no, no company name or anything on it, just, you know, a bunch of, logos there <laughs> they're you know recyclable and don't let a three-year-old play with it <laughs> but, okay let's see okay it does have okay led strip sanding paper sandpaper Whoop. i'm out of range okay and uh then just our pieces no extraneous stuff here okay let's set you to the side and see what we got in this one. And oh. in place. And... All right. That's our front lawn door. <laughs> uh, fairly lightweight. Is this, a, is this a poster or a book? It's a poster. I uh, hate the poster ones. And it does appear to call for glue. I thought it said no glue. <laughs> I guess a symbol without glue and chemicals. So it's a false advertising thing. <laughs> or are they just reusing the box? But let's see, what are we looking at? Actually, it says 50 Sioux steps. That's surprising it's that much, but okay. I can deal with it. That's not, looks like we get to assemble, have some fun assembling. Yeah, let's see, look at the rest of the, uh, oh, which way do they go? Oh, yeah, that. <laughs> look at the rest of the pieces. That, let's see. Okay, there are some pretty good decorations for the house and stuff. There's more. I'll, I'll say this. Seems like there's going to be plenty of decor. I do not see moving parts though, so I'm somewhat relieved of that because I felt I'm the, between the, the clock yesterday and the pinball machine the other week I'm, I'm ready for a nice easy model build so i'm gonna pull my first few steps and i will be back and we'll do some assemblizing all right here we go my preliminary guess is going to be a three-day build so we'll do friday saturday sunday on this one it looks like that's about how long it's going to take if the pace holds up like i think it's going to here so we go do, 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 do. got C2 and D17. Okay, so you just go in, okay, on the corners there. And then the 18 on this side. 
And if I get done with this in like five minutes, we'll uh, definitely pull some more pieces and do some more steps and revisit the time. <laughs> but I don't think it'll be that quick. I imagine it's going to slow down pretty soon after. Okay. And... All right. Looks like I got one tower completed. I start. I like it. Now, six and let's see which one's which. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's got to be these two because they're gonna be matching. Is there any what are the differences between them? Just the looks like the mirror on the. Do, 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 do. But are they otherwise identical? That's the, <laughs> no, the, well, the, the windows are mirrored as well. Okay. But, and the picture. It looks like on the picture, this side is clear. So, I'm gonna go with it on here. And that is a loose fit. <laughs> that may need some glue. If all this other stuff doesn't hold it in. <laughs> oh, but I think actually, and then. This one. Okay, it's actually going to go in here. And down there. Okay, that's going to hold it in. Good, good. And then... This one. And here, and... You down there. Okay. Yeah, so that's... Yeah, that's holding that in good. Excellent. And C7. So you're going to go in... Okay, I'll probably pull all that out. And... <laughs> okay, get you back in. All right. Everything's, yeah. Dig it. <laughs> now we'll just do the same thing on the other side. Actually, I'm going to, I'm going to put C7 on first. <laughs> I thought I would. Oh, but that's as far as it goes. Okay. Let's see if I can get you to cooperate. Okay, that one's a little more snug on that one. So it's now our roof. Likewise, just to make sure the the jagged part of the shingles is going down. A few on here. And there and all right. Yeah, this is going together nicely and it's nice fit, nice fit, you know. Yeah. yeah. I'm so far I'm very pleased with how this is working out. Excellent. And uh, something I did notice while I was doing pulling my parts. Not all the steps are steps, because that three is just, yeah, you're done. <laughs> now, what we're supposed to do is glue these on. And I think, since time is a little bit of an issue here, I'm going to dig out my... Bondic UV glue. Let's see if I can make this work for me. So what? There is a side with a with a stripe in the middle of it. So I just want to make sure you get. And this should be actually fairly forgiving. 
until you expose the UV light as far as being able to position it. Hopefully, fingers crossed. I gotta. I'm just gonna do. I was gonna do a drop there, get a hold of it. Drop there. Drop there and a drop. Hopefully. See how this works. <laughs> Uh -huh. back up. Situated to my satisfaction and hit it. In theory, it just takes a couple of seconds for this stuff to solidify. So that's the, the hope. And it does. I like it. Cool. <laughs> Nothing wrong with the regular white glue. That's what you got. And it'll probably be more accessible. But I say, since I'm trying to do this relatively quickly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm really starting to like this stuff. <laughs> Set you out there because I'm going to need you for the end of the day. <laughs> okay. Now. There. Now. Actually, we do get to set that aside and build some more. Okay, so we take this guy with the opening. Facing, no, wait a second. The picture shows it happened some damage there. <laughs> Did I pull the wrong one? <laughs> no, there isn't another one. There should be, though. No, because that's, that's the... Yeah, okay. The picture's wrong, evidently. <laughs> So we take this guy here, this guy here, and C9 down from the top, and the C17s go in on the sides. Creepy shutters on. I guess by the boxes, technically, that those would be moving parts. <laughs> and then we start on the other side. I think I'll do these first this time. And yeah, I'm, looks like I'm gonna but I'll pull a few more a few more steps because that's because gonna be way too quick of a video. <laughs> and you 
you know, jagged part. Maybe I should go with some slower setting glue. <laughs> All right. Now, bring this guy out. And the same on both. Well, one side's got a different style of damage. So. <laughs> it's. It looks like this side gets this one. Are all those going to line up? Nope. <laughs> right. okay, I am going to take the doors off because I was worried about those. Well, so I'm going to. I'll install them after the fact. So, let me get the bottom two lined up first. Okay. Put those in. Put these guys in. Use our way around, get everybody going home. Alright. Yeah, okay, not too bad. And I'll do it on this side too. <laughs> Okay, I'll have to reapply that one, but I'm not surprised I knocked that off as I'm manhandling this thing. Too bad. One minor discombobulation there. Hopefully, easy to fix. <laughs> just maybe just hit the corners on this one. Like I say, I hit that pretty hard, so I'm pretty sure that's what it really came off. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good thing about an old school haunted house, none of the angles are supposed to be straight, so it doesn't matter if these get on exactly perfect on the window sills, I don't think. <laughs> Okay, and then we're supposed to put this one on here. Like that, so. Mm 
Okay. That's in place. Get our creepy shutters back in place. Okay. That's where I was intending on stopping, but I need to do a little bit more than that, I think, for the... And actually, those might look better if I'm going to have them open. <laughs> I guess it depends on whether you have them opened or closed, which side gets switched, because you want the details showing. Hmm. Well, I say that now those look sort of look sort of suit silly like that, but <laughs> may just have to move them around as you need them for decorative purchases. Yeah, well, yeah, this is looking all right to me. Okay. So let me. I'm going to go pull the pieces for a few more steps and I'll be right back and we'll do just a little bit more. Okay, here we go again. I think I found an even better spot to stop from. So you go. Here. There. Goes around along the top. Tie both of those together. And we get our tower back out. And you go into the top. And this one. This is giving me reminiscence of the Taj Mahal Notre Dame. In the fact these these pieces are fitting together extremely well. I mean, that's I, look that look how tight that seam is around that corner with all those joints. That's impressive. That's some good. That's some high quality tolerances on these edges. And I've got da, 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 da. Let's see which side goes where. <laughs> okay, so. The side with the big hole goes over the side with our shutters. So that means this one goes back here. Then got our shutters there. Where am I at? Okay, well these are the same thing, so it doesn't matter which nope. <laughs> I did that backwards. Try that again. Yeah, yeah I was looking at it the wrong way. Okay, I want... Okay. <laughs> My shutters are here. I want the one with the big hole on this side. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And I say these two are the same, so I just don't. The smaller ones are the same. Then this guy goes here. And this guy in there. All right. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling it, y'all. Okay. Now we take our top <laughs> cornices or whatever. I, no, I don't think that's the right word, but you know, there you go. And on there. There no you know, there's no details on either side of these, so that's there's no out. Sort of the the monster slash Adams family house aesthetic. Y'all, yeah, we got our. Yeah, all right. I like it. Well, that one's not quite down. All right. And if I say the tolerances continue to impress, that's to be a corner like that. That's a pretty good seam. I like. I'm. I say that's. That's. I like it. It's just looking good. I don't need those for the rest of this because I'm just 
The rest is just putting the windows on. So I'm gonna, just on the off chance that I got some stray glue, I'm gonna, I'm gonna allow the doors, to, the shutters to fall off. And that's, okay. And get our bondic out. And just start working our way around it. Four corners. This one, and we get two of the little ones down at the bottom, Whoop. and the big one up top. <laughs> I think I'll do. <laughs> big one first. Yeah, I'll probably do the little ones together. be hitting it that I'm not realizing that was the same I think it's the same one that fell off a minute ago maybe I should shift back to the regular glue <laughs> but I'm having fun playing with this stuff I've got it I might as well use it The one I <laughs> misplaced the one I to already replaced. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna be greedy and try and do two at once again. realized I could have brought y'all in closer for all this <laughs> be a little better view of what I'm actually trying to do <laughs> I'll, sometimes I forget I'm doing this on camera okay let's hit these guys One more 
side. little ones. Oops, I forgot to turn that one backwards. So I wonder if I did that on the other ones. I forgot about the, having the lines on it. <laughs> Did mess up on that one and that all three of them those <laughs> yeah it's proves i was consistent along the sides except for that one. Oh man <laughs> but i'm not gonna take them off at this point because if I, I tried to take them off i'd break them i'm sure <laughs> i could knock them off if i knock them off again i'll fix them right but anyway that is where i'm gonna cut her off tonight put my creepy shutters back on over here I think this is going to be a fun little build, sort of pretty low stress, and like I said, I'm thus far impressed with the precision and quality of the pieces. Good seams, like I said, all the way around, and uh, not bad, not bad at all. All right, folks, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, complain, share, do whatever you want to with all that. Be good to one another, stay safe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.